Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a pop-up form, opt-in pop-up form for MailChimp and uh, which will be usable on WordPress, Google Sites, Magento, uh, Shopify or any other website you have which accepts HTML code, then you can apply this opt-in form, this uh, subscribe collection, collection form on that website. Uh, for this, you will have to log into your MailChimp account and then click on campaigns. Here, click on create campaign. Now scroll down to the sign up form. Click here. Now select the audience for which you want to build this form. I only have one audience. But uh, here you can see embedded form and pop-up form. So we are planning pop-up form. Click on pop-up and then choose your audience and click on begin. Now there are three types of forms. One is modal and Second one is slide, which will be slide from uh, right, top, left or bottom. And one is fixed, which will be uh, stick to your footer like this. So uh, I will choose model. Uh, and now the pop-up setting. So you want the form to be visible immediately after a visitor open your website or you need a 5 second, 20 second delay or you want them to scroll to the middle to show them the form or to the bottom of the page or on exit when user uh, close your page then first they will be uh, notified this pop-up form so i'll make it after five seconds and uh, this is the design of the form for example if you add a photo to this form click on upload choose a picture okay let me add a demo uh, a dummy picture this one click on the picture and click on insert okay here is the picture now uh, now there are uh, three more designs click on right so the form will be look like this or the left like this or no picture at all so I will add this one because this one suits my uh, design now you can change the font of the form this is more dynamic and also you can change the text color let me make it to my website colors which is bluish or pinkish like this something like this and also the background and the button color to be the same some orange color which is hover and alignment center right it's the button alignment I'll keep it on the left the opacity will be the opacity of this area so some of your contents from your background will be visible I'll make it 35 so it will show more of my content in background okay now click on generate code and copy this JavaScript now come to your website I'm using um, Astra and Elementor for WordPress but you can use this code in any of your websites on on the backend okay in the backend 
I'll install a plugin click on add new here in search bar type headers and footer press enter okay I, it is the plugin by WP beginner I already have it you must uh, install and activate this plugin then in the left sidebar there will be a menu in settings insert headers and footers click on that now scroll down to your footer section I already have some code but uh, I'll paste this code all the way down here and save the form now come to your front end and refresh the page and wait for five seconds to appear the form the page is not loaded yet when the page is loaded it will be appeared after five seconds and here is our form when user uh, give their email here and click on subscribe then they will be subscribed to my MailChimp account uh, and that was all for today's video uh, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to our channel so you won't miss our future updates thank you